I want people to feel like, you know what, sad things happen and we can still love life, love ourselves, love each other, find our way through the madness. Well, just to start off, I mean, I know a lot of your previous projects were music videos. I mean, you worked on Step Up, Pitch Perfect. So what was it that drew you to this film about sitting in bars with cake? <laughs> well, I mean, I love music and I love dance, obviously, but I love a good story more than anything. And I love strong, interesting, nuanced characters. So the the uh, like the opportunity to do something like this was an absolute dream. I mean, I knew the minute I wasn't even all the way through the script. I knew that I wanted this movie so bad. It's just such a beautiful story with such great characters and so much heart. Well, you know, Jane and Corinne's relationship is obviously at the heart of this story. So what do you think is most unique about the way the film portrays, you know, female friendship? I mean, I think so many of us can relate to both being the Jane character, the kind of thoughtful, introverted, maybe a little bit shy person in a friendship. And we all know or have been the Corinne in a friendship, you know, the one who's like the cheerleader and the vivacious, sparkly, let's get out. People will follow you to the edge of the earth. They don't even care, you know, get in the van, don't ask questions kind of friend. And so I think there's just something so familiar about that dynamic. And it's real. You know, we all have we all have both of those kinds of people in our lives and probably even in ourselves. So I just loved that it felt like something that was familiar to all of us. And yet we didn't stick with just these two women being sort of cardboard cutouts of those archetypes. I think they are actually quite um, multi-layered characters. And the, the women brought a lot of thought to these characters and their backstory. And they just feel like complex, real people to me. Um, and we just need a lot of that. I mean, I just feel like we all love that. We, there's There's not enough of it. There's more and more every day, but we can all use more of that. Well, the film is definitely very multi-tonal. I mean, you have the woman's plan to make these cakes, get out there and have a good time. But I mean, you also have the diagnosis pretty early on. So how did you want these two plot lines to really kind of feed into each other? When you only have 90 minutes, two hours to tell a very big impactful story in someone's life, you have to pick carefully what moments you're going to show. And I think this sort of absurd paradoxes of life we all know that feeling, whether we've gone cake barring and then gotten a crazy diagnosis the next day or not. We all know those feelings of like life is really fun and celebratory one minute. And then the rug gets yanked out and your whole world is turned upside down the next minute. That's just how life is. So I think that trying not to shy away from that and trying to sort of say, look, I understand people expect a comedy or a rom-com or a, you know, like sappy friendship story. But what if you just sort of threw it all, all the ingredients of that cake into the bowl and just said, but life is a little bit of all of those things. And we don't necessarily have to pick a lane as long as we can braid those ingredients together in a way that feels um, like life and not like a sort of pastiche. Well, lastly, you know, and you kind of just touched on this already, but what message or feelings are you hoping that the audience is going to walk away from, walk away with after they watch this film? I won't be able to be inspired and uplifted. I know that it is sad at moments in this story, but like I said, life is sad. So I want people to feel like, you know what? Sad things happen and we can still love life, love ourselves, love each other, find our way through the madness. And um, sometimes things are just okay. You know, sometimes things end up okay, even when they're hard. And I just... I think with the world being very chaotic for a lot of people right now, it's a message we need to hear. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for chatting with me about the film. Uh, let me just say, I loved it so much. <laughs> I adored it. <laughs> it was I'm absolutely incredible. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Ooh, yes, of course. I cannot wait for everybody to see it. I know. I hope they love it. I hope they love it.